What's up, YouTube? Welcome to Odd3 Garage. And if you're new uh, to this channel, make sure to subscribe and, you know, like the videos. Uh, we got a lot of things in our hands. First off, we got the Mercedes, as you can see by the title. Uh, we got our packages in today. So I'm really excited, man. Really excited. We got the cylinders, we got the oil pan, and we also got the ATF 134 shell transmission fluid. So I'm excited, uh, but before I throw everything in, I'm gonna test these solenoids and all that, especially the uh, TCC one, and just go from there. So hopefully guys, fingers crossed on this, we can get this car off the jacks because I wanna, you know, wash it up, clean it up, and just have it sitting pretty in the yard and stuff, and then focus on the Tahoe, uh, the turbo truck. So if y'all wanna see uh, me boost my truck, uh, y'all stay tuned for that. Uh, if y'all want to see later content for the 944, stay tuned for that. Uh, we're going to take everything one step at a time. Uh, even though I bounce around here and there. Um, I was going to do the 4060 tonight, but like I said, these packages came in. So why not work on the Mercedes and let's get her rolling. So I see y'all. And if y'all returning and y'all already subbed in, man, make sure y'all share, like, and thank y'all, man. I appreciate it. I'm so excited and happy uh, V Day to y'all. So, peace. So, guys, after putting the new solenoids in, uh, everything had tested fine and correct. Um, now, I just had torqued down the valve body. I did about forgot the filter, but good thing uh, I was able to place it in before I added fluid. So, let's get to it. So, guys, we are at the grand finale um i'm finna get my tcm and i'll put it back in and also i'm finna fill her up and that will be it um so once this car get driving like i said fingers crossed um it be able to shift and all that so fingers crossed guys so Whew. guys i'm so well invested into this and i'm trying to get this sorted out so you, this is summer mode right now, uh, but if I switch it to winter, I was supposed to hear like a, a change, but I'm not. <sighs> anyway, I'm in reverse and all that good little thing. Going down to neutral. Going down to drive. Still don't get no indication rather from one or two. Shit so weird. So guys, man, 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 what a interesting other day. Um, I'm not going to get bogged down uh, by the fact that we still have the same issue. Um, it's quite funny, you know, after what replacing nearly everything and we still have the same issue. Um, first off, the shifter was not indicating on the screen. Ended up changing that uh, shifter. Now we got indication. Found the conductor plate. Uh, RPM sensor crap. We also changed the solenoids after the fact, thinking that, you know, fixing them two codes that was uh, getting uh, would solve the problem, but apparently it didn't. So, my only guess to this problem um, is probably the TCM because it's the brain of the car, you know? It's funny because when I try to put it in the winter or summer, I'm not hearing that that different type of like shift. I mean, that feel in the transmission, like you can feel like some type of uh, um, shift in the transmission when I do it. And I also can't put it in one, two, three, or four, the manual gear, I can't do it. Um, Ain't no telling if that thing fried or not because before we had tons of oil in that thing, so, that indicated that the plug had failed and the oil had wicked up to the TCM 
and cause it to fail. And the ATF-134, I don't think is I think it's non-conductive or whatever. Um, and I know for a fact the TCM is not like uh capable. I guess to have like any type of fluid uh just sitting there and all that, you know. Um, I've been looking at forms, uh, doing a lot of research and all that. Um, so I'm learning this stuff that that's the best thing about this process. Uh, it's an interesting long process. I thought everything would have been solved, but it's not. Um, so we just got to take everything one step at a time again and got to keep a positive mindset. Ain't no point of being negative or anything about it. Um, I'm not going to fail. I'm not, I'm not going to give up. I can't give up. But anyway, um, it sucks though, but we gonna I'm gonna remove that TCM and see if I can crack it open. I just need a look uh, to see before I go out and um, buy another stuff. Cause there ain't no telling how much I spent, so I'll probably go back over that, and I'll probably just make a video of like what not, like the mistakes I made, um, what not like the, you know, go over and stuff. Cause I'm basically like a trial run and stuff. I, mean, I ain't seen nobody really like actually like putting videos out here like that on w10s i mean i see good videos but it ain't like nothing i don't know it's just weird because we all had different problems stuff with cars and stuff but anyway it's weird hopefully though we get this uh, uh situation uh figured out like i said fingers crossed hopefully um but it's still getting the same issue so ain't no telling so i'm probably gonna take that tcm uh part so guys, while I'm editing uh, this video, I finally figured out how to uh, take the TCM out. Uh, probably get like a better view of it, but I did take it apart. Um, uh, y'all let me know if y'all see anything. But I do have like a lot of oil residue. I don't know if I have electronic uh, cleaner around me. So that's gonna be pretty interesting. Everything seemed to be normal. It just had like some oil and stuff all on it. You got some oil right there. But we had oil all in it. It's all wet up and stuff. Yeah, y'all can see it is oil. It's kind of hard to tell on the camera. Let this car charge and um, see what I can do. So that's the only thing. So I'll see y'all. Good night. Um, if y'all haven't subscribed, subscribe. If you know, you're returning, make sure to share this, man. Um, and thank y'all. And any tips or anything, let me know. Um, don't be afraid to comment and all that. Um, I really appreciate it. Um, like I said, trial and error. That's all it is, man. And it's fun learning. That's the best part about it. So um, we found bad things, but it's still not fixing our issue. That's the thing that's, you know, kind of like getting me because I don't like doing that. I don't like, I just don't like throwing parts at a car. You know what I'm saying? Um, it's just unnecessary at this point, but we getting the stuff, you know, fixed, you know, we seeing progress, you know, if you seeing progress, you making a steady progress, you have progress, but I mean, I'm going after it. So we're going to, we're going to figure out. And I don't know, it, I might mention, I'm going to mention again, um, the computer hopefully is able to actually like clear the codes, you know, but I mean, it's clearing the codes, but I know, like, say you go to AutoZone, you want no clear codes, but they really not able, not going to be able to, but you have to get like a particular one to actually clear code. That's what I'm thinking, but I don't know. It's kind of weird, but anyway, I'll see y'all. Don't want to keep talking and all that. And on that bombshell, I mean, 
I don't want to just, uh, me personally, I don't like or don't want to overthink things. Um, like I said, we're going to take one step at a time. Um, so, yeah. I mean, that's all we can do. Uh, but anyway, uh, I'll probably make another video on the TCM and just go from there. So, I really hope you have a good night. Just the official close out. Um, don't want to hold anybody up. But like I say, any tips, anything, let me know. And I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys.